Hey, everybody. Here's uh, Patrick Cantley, who played very well at the Players' Championship. And we all know he hits it far, uh, but it doesn't look like it. So where does he get the power from? Um, how, do, what, how does it work? All right, let me explain this to you. I'm going to play it first. You'll see Pat, Patrick just sling it up there and fire it off. And he's got 177 ball speed, which is going to get out there in that 300 range, no problem. Um, so if you've not heard of The Golfing Machine, it is a mechanically descriptive book that explains uh, power accumulators as power sources, and none of them are in the legs. So what they are is, first, as you might notice here, he is getting the club head up in front of him fast, and he's doing that by... The elbow, right elbow folding, that's the number one accumulator. The wrist cocking, number two. And four is the left arm loading up to the shoulders. You, you'll notice that there's not a lot of body rotation going back. So he's loading this with the arms, back muscles and arms. So wrist cock, elbow fold, left arm being pulled up the rib cage, loading uh, way up there. And now what he does on the downswing, he gets the lower body out of the way. So he starts opening up, and now the wrist cock is going to come out, the number uh, two accumulator, and number one, that elbow is still loaded. Remember, the uh, the elbow folds like a hammer, so the hammer is still loaded to pound in this ball. And what it does is once it lets go, you're going to see the elbow straighten of the right side and the left arm get thrown off his body. And let me zoom in and show you where that uh, shoulder socket is, that right shoulder. If you had a glove in there, it would be in Tijuana. That thing is getting fired off so hard, and that's what gives him the smoothness. So he, he lets those arms just sling very hard by uncocking, letting it push the hands out, and then the right elbow straightens and throws a punch like a boxer and slings this thing right around beautifully. Total, Totally great balance. So the golfing machine can explain a lot of this, but it's basically the same as a Sanjay M loading these things up with the, with the uh, arms and the upper body, um, not a bunch of body twisting going back. So you don't see a swirling of the hips and a, um, a Fitzpatrick who uses all body going back and, and doesn't load any of the arms uh, and looks fast, but body fast. So I'm going to play this again for you so now you can really tell. So smooth. So again, this is some of the parts that accumulate power. You add them all up. And number three, we didn't talk about yet, but now I will. The third accumulator is the rolling of the arms. The rolling of the arms right there. It's rolling to the plane on the other side. Perfect. I can kind of draw that plane line. We'll see what that looks like for you. So the plane line is going to be somewhere there goes back, it's parallel to the top there, gets it down on the plane. Now the right arm is gonna fire, the arms are on the plane and the shaft's gonna be parallel to the plane on the other side by the rolling up the incline plane with a ton of speed. So that is how it's done. When you load the arms, wrists, elbow, etc., and let that thing sling, sling with some speed. I'm going to be showing you some other videos here that you want to pay attention to. They're going to be completely different patterns. And I'll explain those too with the, uh, the golf machine terminology, which will help you out. Leave comments below. Subscribe if you would. We'll see you again.